Now for a look at another car that its maker hopes will become a hot item. Here's Lisa Barrow with all the latest motor news. As we mentioned in last week's road test, part of our experience with Ford's new Expedition Sport Utility Vehicle was navigating the wilds of Alaska. And when returning two of those vehicles to the lower 48, Ford decided to bypass Detroit and head way south. A crew of six headed by rally driver Billy Edwards began their journey in Prudhoe Bay, the northernmost point of Alaska accessible by road. Edwards added only high-intensity driving lights, communications and navigational gear, and skid plates to protect the expedition's gas tanks over gravel roads. The spectacular scenery and almost constant daylight gave way to the tedium of round-the-clock driving in four-hour shifts. But drivers and vehicles persevered for over 6,000 miles, arriving in Key West, Florida, the southernmost point in the U.S., in less than 100 hours. The expeditions were trouble-free on their journey through 12 states and three Canadian provinces. And that's it for this week's Motor News.